Welcome to Karen's 10th annual holiday cookie exchange. And since this is my 10th year of hosting this event, I thought I would do it up big with the theme, The Real Housewives of Orlando. You're about to meet 25 of Orlando's hottest housewives who can not only heat up the kitchen with their amazing baking skills, but they really sizzle on the red carpet. So here we go. Let me introduce you to 25 of the smartest, most talented, beautiful women, my dear friends, the real housewives of Orlando. This is my real housewife persona. This is what Ed gets every night. He's so lucky. Ed is a lucky guy. Ed, hope you're watching this. What did I tell you? All right, so here's the thought-provoking question, okay. my dear friends. Okay. And we've had a lot of fun together over the years. Yes, so I know you have an answer I'm, for I'm this. I've worn pink hoodie footie with you on camera. That's <laughs> right, the pink hoodie footie. Should we admit that in public? I, it's out now. People see. I don't All right, so Diane, what is your <laughs> motto when it comes to life and being a real housewife of Orlando? You just got to do it for the fun of it and always have an open bottle of wine. Amen. Oh, yeah. Sisters. Cheers. 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 And I didn't know a good trick to get lipstick off my wine. <laughs> and like, you know, trying to hide it while I was driving. All right, so Tracy, with your funky accent, <laughs> what, what is your philosophy when it comes to life and being a real housewife of Orlando? Mm, I, mm. And being a real housewife? Mm. Of mm. Orlando. Of Orlando. Orlando. I don't know, but my philosophy is always you have to be happy within to make to have other things from the outside make you happy. You got to be happy inside. Amen. Things. And she's happy. And yeah, I'm not sure and what that one. <laughs> 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 yeah. I'm going in between. I'm gonna talk like Jody. Confucius <laughs> says she's happy. The I don't know. Rule is anytime you get an invite from Karen LeBlanc Ulibarri, yeah. you say yes. You That's say yes. Awesome. I oh, trained him well. I need a cook. <laughs> okay, I have to tell you about Krista. Krista obviously doesn't bake. I came for the alcohol. She has other talents um, that don't include baking. And I knew that Krista would be the rule breaker tonight. I knew she would be, but that's okay. She brought her treats. Krista is an amazing... Have I got cat breath? <sighs> no, you're... You're good. Krista is an amazing photographer. Now, you can't tell by the looks of her right now, but Krista does some bang up work from models and actors. <laughs> Seriously, Krista Knowles.com. Um, <laughs> she is an amazing photographer. She takes everyone's pictures in the industry. And I am so I lucky. I can't stop this girl. She's <laughs> like, hey, Justin. She so can sell crap. <laughs> <laughs> like a walk to a horse farm. <laughs> because I don't know what I'd do about her. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart, even though she's a drunkard right now, but not really because she really doesn't drink. I really don't. She's a fake. <laughs> she's good to know. She counsels couples. <laughs> so, Teresa, what did you bring tonight? Okay, I brought uh, the basic chocolate chip cookie with a, with a twist. With a twist? Do you want to tell us what the twist is? Love. Love. I would say. Sorry, I'm Coming cheesy. from a lady who counsels couples. <laughs> so appropriate. And this is and a little something for you and the cookies. And um, this is my first cookie exchange, so you know this is this is like a virgin night for me. So next we have my dear friend Angela Bell Deems. We met on a job several years ago, and she's become one of my closest friends. My yeah. hot, sexy redhead. So Angela, tell us what you brought tonight. I brought some peanut butter cookies with Reese's Cups melted in the center. They're so good, and I'm excited. This is my first cookie party. I've never been to one before, and I get to go to Karen's big 10th anniversary cookie party. I'm so excited. Love the stockings, Angela. Like, what would you say a real housewife of Orlando is? Uh, well, a real housewife of Orlando would be a girl who gets up every morning, walks her dog, makes her husband coffee, works out, and then cleans her house. Oh my gosh, your husband is going to love that answer. A real housewife of Orlando has to be a strong woman. Um, she has to know good friends um, and count on them when they need them, when you need them and they need you. And remember to laugh at everything. <laughs> Which we do. We have a lot of good times, don't we? We do. Thanks for having me, Karen. So, Bye. Jody, what did you bring tonight? Because I know you were really stressed out about this whole I cookie was, thing. I don't normally bake, um, and this is brown butter chocolate chip 
toffee cookie. She makes it even sound so perfect. Brown butter. <laughs> Don't you love the accent? She can make anything sound they amazing. Look bad, but they do taste good. A real housewife of Orlando. Probably somebody that looks good in their bathing suit year round. Because you can be in your bathing suit year round. <laughs> That's one of the perks or downsides of living in a hot, humid, warm climate, right? That's right. You have to watch what you eat all year round. Degrees and divas. Degrees and divas, I like that. How about you, Lisa? I just want to be back in Orlando. My version is that my kids are happy, healthy, and safe. And mama brings home the bacon. <laughs> and fries it up in a pan. Well, we're actually housewives of Lake Mary. That's true. So we are better than Orlando. <laughs> and I say we're a little sassy. We are a little sassy, yes. aren't we? And as you can tell, we're a little provincial about where we live, right? Absolutely. My life motto is... Hmm. Don't say Jersey strong. Um, hmm. Drink, have fun, and then work it off. A real housewife in Orlando is not a housewife. She's a professional. Come here. She's a professional. <laughs> like, like okay. Carol. Yes. Like Carol. Yay, and if you, get an answer. if you need your eyes checked out, go see Carol. A sexy, beautiful, really smart woman. I second you on the smart woman part. Career, fashion, entertaining. I'd say that pretty much yeah. sums it up. Pam is a little camera shy. She's not really thrilled about being on camera. camera. No, I don't Same like being on camera. <laughs> so tell us what you brought tonight, Pam. Crispy peanut butter balls. Okay, and Pam <laughs> can't no bake. No bake. <laughs> like, what's your motto? Well, I like to have our girls' lunches, a little tennis in the morning. Um, what else do we do? You know, it's like living the glamorous life. You're she sounds you like a Stepford so wife, funny. doesn't she? You are so funny. Okay, bye bye. Ta ta. Bye bye. Like, what would a cook exchange be like in Louisiana? Um, it would involve some um, aluminum foil <laughs> that they just pulled off the window, and maybe a little bit of raw cookie dough <laughs> dipped in peanut butter. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what does that say about where we came from? Um, it says a lot. A rural housewife of Orlando is having a beautiful home, great, a great family, great children, raising your family well, wonderful friends, and meeting new friends, and enjoying your time. Mm, enjoy life. A good multitasker that always looks good, always on their game, a good mom, and always a good wife. Oh my goodness, spoken like a true pro. Make it till you make it. That totally, totally defines Kim Carr. Very well put. Bravo. Thank you. Did you rehearse that? None at all. Could I have a question for you? Okay. What makes you the best Real Housewife of Orlando? All right, well, here's my philosophy. I believe life is short. You got to have fun along the way. So I say enjoy the ride and if you want to hang with me, strap in and hang on because it is one wild ride. Like a ride. Roller coaster. Rolling, rolling. Let's go roll. We're going to go join the party with the other Real Housewives of Orlando, but without all the cat fights. Yes. We're good. We're nice. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Melissa, come get a picture with us. Come get a picture.